what up, spam fam? She's getting thick, making it very hard to dive into. Ah, this is actually the prompt we're doing. We're going to create a spinner. I toyed around with so many ideas for this because... How do you make like, this interesting, really? Honestly, tell me. Tell me how you make a spinner interesting. Whatever. <laughs> but basically it's saying to... Ah! Make a... Cut that out. That's better. When the clowns are not as scary as the previous drawing. <laughs> that page is bad. So, it was telling me to cut the spinner out, but because I'd already done the previous page, I would have been... I, I, I would have been fine with cutting it out, but... Because it was horrifying, but... So, I've redrawn the circle. I've lined it. Uh, we're now going to colour it. I'm not sure what colours to do it though. <laughs> uh, I messed up. So I'm obviously going pink and green. <laughs> I have no shame, okay? I don't care. I mean, I will care when my pink and green pencils have run out. Because I, I have still not found where I can buy just pink and green pencils. I mean, people have been suggesting places like Michael's and whatever. We don't have those here in the UK. The equivalent is Hobbycraft. But here's a fact about me. I haven't been in a store in four years. <laughs> <laughs> like the only place that I go is to the vets that's the only place that I'll go in I don't go in shops so without physically going into a store uh, the reason I don't is people uh, I have anxiety and enclosed spaces with people is bad for me but I need a place online that I can buy them. <laughs> but back to the spinner. <laughs> I've created the spinner and I have written a whole bunch of page numbers on there. So I'm going to spin that wheel and it's going to select the next prompt. I have no idea if this is going to work. So... A disclaimer, I had to redo my paint. That is still tacky because of that paper stuff I used on the other side. Oh, oh, well. <laughs> I mean, it's not exactly ruined. <laughs> it's improved. <laughs> but I had to redo my paint and I could not get my colour right and that's the green that it came out like the pink's fine it's pretty much the same but the green is just i have no idea what that is it's not my green i know that <laughs> but it's fine i have a new paint tray thing so i'll just redo it and try and remake my green <laughs> Spin the wheel. I didn't really have a plan for this page. And if I'm honest, 
I had been going through a weird patch. It's like... Um, I didn't have art block. But it was art block. Like, I couldn't come up with any, any decent ideas, so... Struggling. Like, my partner thought it was burnout. <laughs> so, we're going to spin this wheel. I haven't actually tested whether this is going to work yet, so this could be an absolute fail at this point. <laughs> I made an arrow. Because Mariah's prompt says to put a pin, like a pencil, through the hole of a paperclip and spin it. So I stuck an arrow on a paperclip. I need, I need to put a hole in the actual spinner. That would help. <laughs> I haven't tested whether this works, so whatever it lands on is not the next prompt, just to be clear. This is just testing. Kind of works. Doesn't get much spin. I mean, it's getting a bit of motion, isn't it? So I guess it works. Yeah. Approved. Okay. Let's spin this thing. So it, it kept landing on the uh, on the line. I mean, on the camera it doesn't look like that, but from my angle it looked like it was landing on the on the line. So the arrow can just clip onto the side there like that. So what did we land on? What was the prompt? Mm. This one. Which is create abstraction. Draw a face. Draw a face, but with jumbled up features. Name your character. Oh, I'm sorry, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is your warning. I did have some issues. I told you, I was going through like a funk. It was... Like I say, not art block, because I was still having the ideas, they just weren't good. <laughs> and this is one of them. I sometimes put too much pressure on myself, I think. And... Yeah, I... Think I had done that. My partner kept saying it was burnout. Because I do record, I guess, six days a week. I record pretty much every day. I Sundays I have off either that or I do digital on Sundays. I mean, in my defence, it is abstract and it is a jumbled up face. Things just got a little weird. I think I passed weird. <laughs> I passed weird and jumped straight into Looney Town. What I should have done, I think... What would have helped was to leave some, like a forehead. Because it just looks a little weird, but we'll get to that.
So I'm trying to make this as weird and strange as possible. But like I said, I think I went overboard on the weird for my liking. I'm trying to make all the colours wrong as well, so normally my avatar spam would have pink lips. She's got green lipstick. She's got a purple tongue. Well, that looks blue on camera. Her eyes are on her hands. She has a big mouth. <laughs> Takes up her whole face. And then I wasn't sure how to do the eyes because I was like, are they sideways eyes or is she looking at the world in portrait? <laughs> so when I was drawing them, I couldn't figure out that situation and like I said if I'd left a little bit of forehead it would have looked like hair but this is hair that I'm coloring now and it just it doesn't look like it because it just looks like stripes in the background because the only bit of face that's left is the jawline and the neck which kind of get lost in the background. I mean, it's definitely abstract. I guess I nailed it, but compared to other things that I've created abstract wise, this is a fail for me. This whole episode is a fail. But that is art. what I've learned along the way I fail on some things but then I keep that in mind for the next thing that I do which is annoying <laughs> because I'd love to create perfect art all the time hell I'd love to do it just once <laughs> but I guess in everything we I look at things and I go, hmm, I'd change this about that. I'd do this with that. But with traditional art, I can't change it unless I redo it all. But then what would I learn? So I also decided not to do skin tone. She went like a turquoisey blue colour. Do you know what? I think that it's the background. I think it's the hair in the background. If I had just left some forehead to make it look like hair I might have got away with it but I like the lips I like the tongue I like the mouth the mouth is perfectly drawn I think and the teeth the bottom teeth I've never done those before it was quite fun to draw I like the colours together, like the skin tone and the lips and the tongue. It's just the background, I think. But there you go. I'm just going to finish this off, figure out what I'm going to do with the rest of the mouth. I did ruin it slightly. I tried to fix it and then I overfixed it. See, I tried to put these lines in here. <sighs> I hate this episode. <laughs> You're gonna have to let me know what you think down below. I'm sure 
some people might like it. But I think it definitely needed a forehead. It's definitely abstract, but this was a fail, the spinner was a fail. I don't know whether it was a fail for this. I think it's the green that's off for me, like the background green is just not right. It looks dirty. I don't know whether that's the right word, but it looks like a dirty green. But let me know what you think down below. I am done with this episode. Goodbye. <laughs> like if you want. I don't blame you if you don't poo episode. But if you want to subscribe, subscribe. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I will be back cheerier and happier. Like, subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one. <laughs> Bye!